episode 130. I hope you're very well this week and this week I've been having some big adventures with this beautiful instrument. This nickel harper has been really unhappy because, uh, well because England's quite damp actually and um, and so what can happen is that it can make the keys swell. Now if you're a nickel harper player like you know all about this. This is the first time I've had to do it so um, I've been pretty terrified. If you're not a nickel harper player, what happens is the keys can, the wood of the keys can swell up a little bit and then as you push them in, they don't come back down again. So everything you play after then on that string basically sounds like a rattly mess. So <laughs> I got to a point at a concert on the weekend where I was like, okay, just don't play D and A. Don't, don't play them. <laughs> so, um, but I need, I need the instrument to work, of course, for, um, well, for one, for my London gig. Come to my London gig next Monday, Monday 4th July. Okay, uh, so this is, uh, this is me uh, two days ago uh, taking apart this lovely instrument. Hi patrons, I thought I'd just show you what I'm up to this morning and I'm not going to show you me because you do not need to see me right now and I am taking apart my nickel harper which is something I have never done before and I am desperately hoping works <laughs> so it's been a little bit of a jigsaw puzzle to take it apart and basically to try and work out how little I can do in terms of loosening the strings and you know the minimum amount of screws and things to to take apart but it's a pretty fascinating instrument so I thought I'd just show you all of these keys I've got the keys here from the A string the D string ones G string and the C string ones and I have two keys here which have been causing me a lot of trouble to the extent that the instrument is basically unplayable <laughs> and I've been avoiding those two keys but I can't do it I've got my London show for the album launch coming up on Monday so I've just had to bite the bullet and do this and I'm basically completely terrified that it's not all going to go back together and <laughs> If it does, then it might not, uh, I might not have even fixed the problem, but I kind of have to have a go because there are not, um, nickel harp is such, such a minority instrument basically that there are not enough uh, people around who could help me. So, um, yeah, okay, here you go. <laughs> I'll let you know in a little while what's, uh, whether it's worked. And as you can see now, although it took all of the Queen's horses and all of the Queen's women, we have got the nickel harper back together again with all of the keys coming down. So I'm going to celebrate with a lovely Polska, Polska after Gustav Persson for you. <laughs> 